Where are you from, Johnny? <laughs> Eldrie, Eldrie. Good to see. Oh my God, we've got a wee fan club there. Cut off, people. Woo! People booing. Eldrie, obviously. Coat Bridge. Coat Bridge, Eldrie. <laughs> anybody, anybody not from Scotland? Anybody come further afield than Eldrie? Which is a pretty depressing question to ask. South Africa, all right, my lady, my lady. I only know that for the Oscar. I just know South Africa for all the wrong reasons. <laughs> <laughs> the Pistorius trial, that's all I've got for you. That was... <laughs> that was a great holiday, wasn't it, watching the murder trial? Oh, my lady, I didn't know it was Riva, my lady. <laughs> if only that had made it to South Africa, uh, uh, when somebody was talking shite. That trial needed a whole jury. Oh, my lady, I didn't know it was her. Ba -ba -ba. <laughs> <laughs> welcome, welcome. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. You, know, you should have got him steaming. That's it. That's how you get the truth out of any man. Get him fucking hammered. <laughs> That's a, that's a lie detector in court. Get a few cans on him. Let him start unwinding a bit. Then get him on the shots. Then get him at the point he's lighting his fag, but he's talking that much shite, his fag keeps going up. Then he's hammered. <laughs> All right, I'll fucking tell you what happened. I was busting for a shite. <laughs> hey. And she was taking fucking ages. <laughs> I was touching cloth, my lady, and I panicked. <laughs> South Africa. Em, they're not from Scotland. Where have we got? Where are you from? Detroit. Detroit. No oh, fucking shit, man. <laughs> Detroit. Genuinely. What's your name? Jennifer. Jennifer from Detroit. How long have you been in Glasgow, Jennifer? A decade. A decade. That's that's ten year in Glasgow. Talk. <laughs> ten year, you say. None of that decade shit. You would fail your citizenship test on that, Jennifer. <laughs> Ten year. You don't say years, none of that plural pish either. Ten year. <laughs> you get a very honest game of Scrabble in Glasgow. <laughs> years, nah, he's not getting five for that, no chance. <laughs> Detroit, no fucking way, man. I love from Scotland, we're on the map. We attract tourists, people from all what People give a fuck about Scotland these days. What is that to hear? Put on the map, especially last year, we had the Civil War, didn't we? Scotland. <laughs> People ask, if I had an American Jennifer in a pub in New York asking me about that, about the, the big vote we had, the guy, it's, it's difficult to explain. The guy's going, hey, hey man, are you from Scotland? Uh, I said, yes. I was going to say aye, but I translated. <laughs> I said, yes. I'd been on the Rosetta Stone prior to the trip. And the guy goes, what the fuck happened over there, man, in Scotland? Like, who would have thought Scotland would vote against freedom? Like, what the fuck? And I go, that was a bit more complicated than that, pal. <laughs> and he's going, what about William Wallace and Robert the Bruce? You guys fucking said no. I will be thought Asda were going to put their prices up. We're a proud people, pal, but I don't know how much we're prepared to pay for crispy pancakes. It <laughs> was a crazy time, wasn't it? Scotland that left us questioning our whole identity. Even I'm looking at Scottish money. No wonder the English don't accept this shite. Who is that guy? <laughs> That's not the fucking Queen, mate. It's not the Queen. I know it's not the Queen, mate. I don't know who it is. Just some guy, mate. <laughs> Just Clydesdale Bank's employee of the month for Sunday. <laughs> oh, no, just be happy for the wee guy. Picture him in a house party. Six in the morning, showing his pals his note. I'm on the note like that, rolling up, snorting coke through it. <laughs> Look at me no more, I'm a tenor. <laughs> I 
Uh, we all get into it, don't we? Politics. We've got a whole country that could go back and reset higher modern studies. It's good. It's an education. <laughs> Sitting on Facebook, posting links to articles you've not even read yet. That was us. <laughs> People threatening to leave the country. M Michelle Moan. She left, didn't she? Michelle Moan. Something. <laughs> Somebody needs to sit her down. Michelle Moan. Mon Michelle. Mon. Monty fuck Michelle. <laughs> <laughs> You're a political man, Johnny. Nah, you don't give a shit. Nah. I watch it, I get into it. I like the politics. I've started buying the big paper. I never knew the big papers were as expensive. I thought it would just be the same price. No, standing in the queue, news agent, my pound coin, making plans for the change. <laughs> a one pound eighty. Oh, fuck, do you take card, mate? <laughs> yeah, only if it's over a fiver. Oh, just, all right, a Daily Telegraph and 16 packets of hubba bubba, mate. That's just like, <laughs> I watch it. The Tories, that's what I've got. Reducing the deficit, the economy. That's what's going on. Austerity Britain, making cuts. I watch, I watch them. David Cameron, we must, we must work together to reduce the deficit. That's what's going on. Reducing the deficit. I read about the deficit. Do you know about the deficit, big guy? Do you know Britain's debt? No, 1.5 trillion pound. That's how much the UK owes somebody. <laughs> <laughs> 1.5 trillion pound. I don't know who the fuck we owe that to, but <laughs> surely they've gave up on it. Surely. <laughs> surely when it hit the trillion mark, they must have been having their doubts about ever seeing it back. <laughs> I've enjoyed Greece. I like their attitude. That's how you treat debt. If, if in a great time, it's got to the end. Everybody's on their case, the IMF, the EU, and they're just telling them to go and fuck themselves. Good on. <laughs> well done, Greece. Angela Merkel on the phone, going fucking mental. <laughs> Greece have just got her on loudspeaker, just laughing at her. <laughs> Sitting, drinking bottles of Ouzo, letting her shout at them. <laughs> you must make the repayment now! <laughs> 240 billion euros! through books on Greek philosophy, trying to quote their way out of the mess. <laughs> Angela, as Socrates said, <laughs> he is richest who is content with least. That's a fucking beauty, man. Any more? <laughs> Or as Epicurus said, do not spoil what you have by desiring what you have not, Angela. <laughs> yeah, let me talk to you. <laughs> or as Plato says, you're not getting it, you fucking cow. <laughs> Everybody knows somebody like Greece. I've got mates like Greece. <laughs> They're likable, but you don't lend them money unless you're prepared to deal with their shite when you try and get it back. <laughs> well, have you seen that? Johnny, Greece actually accused Germany of owing Greece 279 billion euros because of the Nazi occupation in the 1940s. Fucking classic tactics. Oh, we weren't going to mention it, Angela, but since you're chasing us up, 